Dark Lord. Moth Pyron ready to report. What do you have for me, Pyron? Your apprentice Ashara briefed me on the Order of Revan. We are discreetly sweeping for infiltrators in your ranks. Good. If I may, I've also prepared a briefing on current military operations. I'll endeavor to be quick. As for the Selenon campaign, Darth Maar is coordinating the Joint Armada with minimal losses. That does raise the issue, however. Our silencer fleet killers are underperforming as the Republic adapts tactically and technologically. We may be able to refine the silencer cannons further, but their radiation output will begin to kill our own gunners. Shall we proceed? Make the refinements, but post a skeleton crew to any ship so equipped. We have only so many troops to spare. Yes, Dark Lord. There is also the question of Alzar. Darth Ravage still believes the natives hold no value and expands rapidly into their territory. Your overseers on Korriban believe the Alzarians might be trained as Sith, but to recruit them now could make an enemy of Ravage. Ravage is a useful ally. He may crush the Alzarians with my blessing. We'll find new acolytes elsewhere. As you wish. One last order of business. I understand you're on Rishi. Normally, I wouldn't bother you with trivialities, but... Speak, Pyron. You have a servant there by the name of Lord Vigil. Like many, he's been seeking an audience since your ascension. He won't say why or speak to anyone but you. However, Thanaton clearly prized him. He received significant resources for his research. Do we know anything about what he's doing on Rishi? Vigil was designated a seeker into matters exotic and arcane. Quite a few of your researchers have this designation. Whether Vigil's work is productive or, like certain other legacy projects, mere eccentricity is not for me to judge. Where do I find him? I'll send coordinates. Perhaps your archaeologist might assess Vigil's work with some insight as well. Then you are dismissed. My life for yours, Dark Lord. I'm ready when you are. Yes, sir. 
I recall Vajal's name, but we've never met. What do you suppose he's found out here? Darth Nox, everlasting night lord. It is my deepest honor to welcome you to Rishi. I'd begun to doubt <laughs> I was a fool. You sought an audience, and I have come. The reclamation service will observe. On my life, I shall not disappoint. I was sent here 30 years ago, not for Rishi, but to stand on the brink of the Rishi maze, the dwarf galaxy. Thousands of unexplored worlds just beyond the known hyperlanes. My master tasked me to monitor those dark stars. First he demands my presence. Now he tells me he's been stargazing. Does he deserve to be punished? Hear me out, Dark Lord, I beg you. There's always been rumors about the maze. I admit he has me curious. Proceed. I built a deep space communications array to watch, to listen, to try to contact the maze's inhabitants. And I, I received signals, messages. The language is ancient, uh, contemptuous of translation. Uh, there are Sith words. Rakata. Gri. The messages contained instructions for improving, modifying the communications array. Uh, even I don't understand what functions the machines now possess. These modifications, the technology, did the signals hint what they might be for? Only in that the technology would grant a great boon. Um, I couldn't discern more than that. Alien machine enhancements. Hmm. Hmm. Now we know where the Reclamation Service budget went. The signals went silent some years ago, but I believe the array is now waiting for you. Waiting for me? The last messages said the array required one twice transmuted and reborn to the mother. Transmuted, as I was on Balmora, and by the corruption of the Sith spirits. And then rejuvenated by the mother machine of Belsarvis. Fascinating. Some distant species has been waiting for you, Dark Lord. Whether by prophecy or biology. You could activate the array. Learn its purpose. By fate or happenstance, we're here now. I won't turn away from a mystery. I'll examine your machines. Await my return. Yes, Dark Lord. Yes. As they say in the service, the prudent learn, the bold are enlightened. Yes, sir. Genetic flux analyzed. The Tesseract is free. Subject confirmed. The Dark Lord's lifespan is by one solar cycle. Yes, sir. Genetic decay analyzed. Redeem or destroy. Subject identified. The Dark Lord's oh. life speed by one soldier's life.
ready when you are. Are you okay? That looks like it has its mark analyzed. Someone must be sacrificed. Subject identified. The Dark Lord's life is resisted by one solar cycle. that needs exploring. Life death balance recorded. Beware of his desires. Subject identified. The Dark Lord's lifespan is by one solar cycle. Lord Vagel. Was all to your satisfaction, my lord? Were the machines responsive? The Dark Lord's lifespan increases by a solar cycle. Does that mean something to you? Then it was real. What was real? Real. Arctis believed, Thanaton believed, but I doubted. I, I feared to offer you false hope. The machines are made to increase life expectancy, cellular rejuvenation. For, for anyone without your uh, exotic past, the process would surely have failed. But for you, Dark Lord, those machines have granted you months or years. A taste of immortality. A taste of immortality. I've awaited this opportunity. But I desire more than a few extra dying breaths in my twilight years. Oh, of course, of course. Then grant me the means to fulfill your wish. Grant me battalions to pacify this world. Grant me scientists to replicate the machines. Grant me fleets to explore the dwarf galaxy. 
Now we know the secret to your everlasting glory is here. We need only find it. My lord, I have concerns about this course of action. Consider the wisdom of questioning my path to eternity. Already considered, my lord, but I would be remiss to stay silent. The long search for immortality so often leads to ruin. You saw this with your first master. Who will count Zash among the great Sith when she squandered her power on a fruitless quest? And now, with our empire in such need of your resources... I will remember your counsel, but I am not Zash. Lord Vajal, Moff Pyron will supply you troops as soon as possible. Keep me informed of all progress. Yes, Dark Lord. If it requires a year and a thousand men for each month of life you gain, it will be done. Good. For now, I have an empire to run and crises to see to. All glory to Darth Nox. All glory to you. <laughs> Ufal Alesi Rikichicha.